So I'm gonna be guys showing you today in this video our strategy that you can trade with to make a lot of money with and Today on this video, we're gonna be doing the one minute chart. You can do the five minute 15 minute one hour. It doesn't matter But today we're gonna do that. We're gonna do a very high percentage win rate strategy. So let's go ahead and run out and get into it. So Head over to the indicators tab and add in at EMA, which is going to be the exponential moving average. Add in two of them, just like so. And you want to make 150 on length, just like that. And then you want to make one with 150. Let's actually change the color of these. So let's make this a white line on the 150. And then on the 50, let's make this a red line. There we go. Now let's add in another indicator. It's going to be the stochastic. Stochastic. There we go. And then also, last but not least, let's add in sessions on chart. There we go. Now let's edit the settings real quick for the sessions on chart and get rid of Tokyo. And the reason why we're getting rid of Tokyo is because Tokyo doesn't have a lot of volume. As you can see, Tokyo session is right here. Let's also make this a white color for you guys. And there we go. And there is no volume. It's all flat. So when uh, when the UK London session and also USA happens, a lot of volume comes in. And then here it opens again, comes in again, and then it stops. And it kind of like dries down a little bit. And then there's going to be the Tokyo coming and it's going to be flat. So, you know, it makes a lot of sense to get rid of Tokyo because we don't want to trade now. Anyways, so basically... As you can see right here, also in the stochastic, uh, we haven't changed these to five. So let's do that real quick, five, five, five. And there we go, it's updated. So the way to make money with this strategy is pretty simple. What you're gonna have to do for the confirmation of a long trade or a short position is gonna be based off of the EMAs and also the stochastic and the trend, right? So if we look at the stochastic right now and we can see that they're currently if it's going to be a bearish chart, the red will be below the white. So the red is the EMA 50 and then the white is the 150. So if the 50 card keep above the 150, that means it's a bearish chart. And right here, we can see that it's going to be underneath the white. So that's going to be a bonus for entering a short position. And then what we need to do guys also is we need to be making sure that the stochastic is going to be near the highs or we'll say above the half at least. And when you try to enter, this is going to be the main entry point. So the price is going to have to be pulling back to the 150 like this. So when the price is underneath the 150 and it goes to retest it like here, um, you have to make sure also it doesn't close above and it can continues to ride the trend because you have to make sure that the higher lows uh, can, don't continue and we make a new lower low. So right here is the low. We've got a new low and a new one and then the lower low happens here. So... As you can see, we did test the 150 right here perfectly. And on the RSI, the orange has to be crossing underneath the blue. So right here, we have a cross. And then so the confirmation is going to be right here on this candle. So what we do is make a long, uh, a short position just like this. Oops, sorry, so this candle here. And the RSI, well, the stop is going to have to be above just a little bit on the swing, uh, swing high right there and target in a 1.5R trade. Let's do it right now. And there we go. So there's a perfect trade for you. All right. So if you put in $100, you might go to $150. So that's the entry requirements for a short position. And basically for a long position, it's the exact opposite, just for a different trend, right? So as we can see right here, we are somewhat getting a cross here on the 150, but we don't pull back towards the 150. To create a bullish trend so we, that doesn't count uh, let's have a look somewhere where we can potentially enter a long position so here we are and as you can see the ema 50 is above the ema 150 we also have a cross on the stochastic with the orange cross in the blue and remember it doesn't always have to touch it exactly it just has to be close to it so right here we can look for an entry of a long position soon because guess what we're also making higher lows Right here is the low, we make a little bit of a higher low. And right here too, this is a higher low compared to this one right here. So what we're gonna do now is make a long position and we're gonna enter from the top of this green candle because we can clearly tell this is a reversal. And it's gonna be stop loss on the swing low, just a little bit on the um, 
below it and then 1.5 return right there so there you go it's a clear win again if you deposited 1k you now got 1.5k all right so there you go that's the strategy now what i'm going to be doing i'm going to be testing this strategy with trader edge to see if this strategy works and what the percentage win rate is and see how much money we can actually make from this strategy so i'll be back to you guys in 10 minutes so here we are with the statistics of this strategy and boy oh boy this is an 82% win rate strategy. It's so good. PL is up by 600%. So we profited basically $6,800 just from depositing $1,000. The total trades we took was 100 trades, uh, 82 wins, and 18 losses. Profit factor of seven, which is crazy good. Also, max consecutive wins was 12, which means that I won like 12 trades in a row. And the consecutive losses was only two, so I lost two in a row, but that's the max that we had. Um, max drawdown, 2% also, and uh, that's really it. This, I mean, this trade strategy is good to go. I would definitely use this if you trade your US dollars, even any Forex. It plays it more safer because they follow a trend better. Now, guys, you know what to do already. Leave a like on this video, subscribe, post notifications, and join the Discord down below. Peace out.